Annie Slater, and today I'm here to tell you a little bedtime story. Just kidding. This is a story about morning time. Oh, oh hello. My whole life there has been nobody cooler than my big sister Sarah. Maybe Britney Spears. When I was finally old enough to hold a spatula, I remember one morning my sister came to me and said, Hey fan, do you think you can make me breakfast? So what did I make her? Drum roll please. Cheese toast. I mean, give me a break, I was like seven. I remember so proudly displaying my cheese toast to her, and being the amazing big sister that she is, she said, this is the best cheese toast I've ever had. From that point on, my sister has never stopped asking me to make her breakfast. And even though now she lives all the way on Oahu in beautiful Hawaii, when we get together, guess who's the one getting their fanny in the kitchen? Now, one thing that's changed with my sister's diet over the years is that now she tries to avoid dairy. So the other so day, I happened to be in my mothership, and I found this awesome product called Kite Hill. So Kite Hill is an artisan cheese product, and it's made from almonds, which means it's got lots of protein and a really great nutty flavor. Now, my sister's always like really big, bold flavor, so I decided instead of going for the plain, I would opt for the chive cream cheese spread. So while I was at Whole Foods thinking about this new age modernized breakfast I could make for my sister, I decided to pick up some non-Whole Foods makes a really good whole wheat variety. So I've got my Kite Hill dairy-free chive cream cheese. I've got my Whole Foods whole wheat non-bread. Try saying that five times fast. I've got some Whole Foods cage-free brown eggs and a little bit of basil. So now I think it's time for me to introduce you to my non-dairy, non-breakfast pizza. This one's for you. So to crisp up this naan bread, we're gonna put it in a baking sheet, drizzle it with a little bit of olive oil, season it with a little salt and pepper, and into a 400 degree oven it goes. And now that the naan bread is crisping in the oven, we have eight to 10 minutes to eat the Kite Hill Chad cream cheese with a spoon. Okay, now that we've got this really crusty whole wheat naan bread as the base of our breakfast pizza, I'm gonna spread the Kite Hill Chai cream cheese on just like it's our sauce. Come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii with me. Now it's time to do what any breakfast loving person would do. Hashtag put an egg on it. In case you get the and if you're trying to figure out where you know me from, it's probably from winning the Rachel Ray Great American Cookbook Competition. And if you close your eyes and dream. Or you may have seen me in the hit film Picture Perfect, not the one with Jennifer Aniston. Although, I know. Hawaii, come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii with me. Come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii with me. Hawaii, come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii with me. We hear our mama call o'er the ocean, and we know that it's time to come in. Come and come and come and come. Thanks for watching, and remember, you can get all of these ingredients at your local Whole Foods. You'll probably even find me there, or you can just tune back in here every week to get your fanny in the kitchen and make delicious dishes just like this one. A little privacy, please. Little town, why don't you come to Hawaii? Come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii with me. Come to Hawaii, come to Hawaii. Come to Hawaii. Come to Hawaii.